we'll now restart the engine. So let's take off again and I'll show you the slow flight and I'll show you how maneuverable the PLV is. But because you don't have a stall speed, you cannot fall out of the air like a fixed wing airplane. You don't have to worry about stalling at all. The rotor will still keep turning if you go very slowly. So we cannot hoover like a helicopter, but we can fly really slowly on a straight line. So our minimum level horizontal airspeed is 50 km an hour, which I'll demonstrate right now. So with the PLV you can fly slowly and low to the ground relatively safely. I will now demonstrate a really steep turn. You can store the vehicle speed in the rotor when you pull up in a corner. So if you pull up on the stick, the rotor will accelerate, the vehicle will slow down, you can make a really short turn and you get this rotor speed in the form of lift when you turn the other way. This means you can easily avoid obstacles or uh, return from a valley that is too steep to climb out on the other side. The trim system works from all the way from minimum horizontal speed up to the maximum speed of 180 km an hour. So even if you're flying very fast, you can still let go of the stick and don't have to worry about the stability of the PLV. It will still counteract all the disturbances it gets from uh, wind gusts or uh, thermals or other disturbances. Now make another steep turn. I'll show you a vertical descent. So because the rotor still keeps turning when the wind comes from underneath, you can do a safe vertical descent. So if I take the throttle back all the way, pull back on the stick and reduce the vehicle speed, the rotor will still keep turning at 300 rpm. And you come down almost vertically, even going reverse a little bit. You still have full control over the vehicle because the, the rotor is still keep turning and uh, you can easily turn right, turn left, push forward and pull up. If you want to land from a vertical descent you do have to uh, apply a little bit of throttle or push the stick forward to make a nice flare for the landing. Alright, that was the flying of the PAL-V. 